Where are we, Mom? Uh, we're by the Warner Brothers Studios. Warner Brothers Studios. Oh my, that is huge! Wow, incredible, isn't it? Oh my word! Oh man, look at that. That's the water tower. Got Bugs Bunny right there. Got the duck right there. Warner Brothers Studios. Felix walking up, things I can't hear. See, it's up right there. We're ready. That's German according to Felix. Yes. Yes, it well. means welcome. <laughs> we got the Il Kevier and School of the Dark Knight. I think that's um, in Dutch or Inception that looks like Japanese. Or great. See Dallas, that's operations of the facility. There was Jack who became yeah. the face of the company. The peacemaker to be friends. Are you watching it? I do. Cool. Thank you for reporting. This is the Warner Brothers. I saw this either, but <laughs> that is cool. Oh, you can't see it. So this is the set for the friends. This is the set for the I gotta let go detach. Oh no! I recently graduated from Hogwarts with my wand. I'm in my cloak. I just took a nap. I was gonna go to Dancing with the Stars. I decided not to. Me, my sister, Felix, and my mom didn't go. So we're here. We're at the house. I just took like a one and a half hour nap. And we're going to get Mexican food in a minute. And then we're gonna go see, I think, Jack Reacher, whatever it is. Uh, my dad wants to go see it, so we're gonna go. But in the meantime, we have like 30 minutes before we leave and I'm bored, so I'm gonna vlog. And I wanted to vlog about the comparison between Los Angeles and New York City because um, when I'm older I want to live in one of the two cities and hopefully you can take my perspective into account so I'm just gonna say right now uh, I like New York more just like straight up uh, one yes it's kind of biased just because I'm like oh yeah I want to live there but two um, there's like some pros and cons of it so the pros the pros about New York are it's New York City um, a lot of history behind it um, if you think of America, then the first thing that pop into your head is probably New York. Um, it's just like, it's got that feeling, you know. It's just got like everything that you want. Um, it's big, it's close together, everything is nearby. You're never like three miles away from one thing. Like, um, I don't know if that makes any sense, but like, 
you're always close to everything. You're not gonna have to go like six miles out to get somewhere like you do here. Uh, Hollywood sign, it's right up there. You can't see it. Um, it's three miles away, but it takes 25 minutes to get by car. So there's that. Um, I had a bunch of things, but I forgot them now. Chris Los Angeles is everything is more spread out, right? Um, so that can also be a con, but I'll explain the pro in a minute. So it's easier to drive everywhere. Um, New York City is, it's like hell to drive through. It's terrible. If you, if you own a car in New York, it's terrible. You either take the subway, take a bus, take an Uber, take a taxi. Those are the only four things you do. If you have a bus, I, I'm sorry, if you have a car, good luck. Here, having a car is good. Everything is spread out. You'll be suburbs for two miles, then you'll get into the little city of Los Angeles. The actual, like, downtown is very small. Then it'll get to more suburbs. So it's like suburbs, then little, little dot that is Los Angeles. So, yeah. So it's like this, and then a little dot. Um, that can also be a con because you are far away from everything. Um, for example, Warner Brothers Studios was a 35-minute drive, and it is five miles away. In New York, to get five miles, you might be on the subway for ten minutes. Here's that. Um, and then, oh yeah, another pro of New York was that everything is close together, right? It's like you just have to take the subway one step down, one stop down to get to where you need to go. It can also be a con because a the traffic is terrible. It sucks. It sucks so bad. I've never seen worse traffic. Um, and then everything is tight, so everything is packed in. So even though you're close to everything, you're tight. Like you'll know, you know what I mean. If you've been to New York, you know what I mean. If you haven't, um, just watch any like movie and you'll get it. Um, and then one last thing that I want to talk about, it, it's like the advantage is Los Angeles and it's um, like cleanliness. The streets here compared to New York are so much better. New York, there's trash everywhere. Like it's bad. Here, there's trash everywhere. It's just not as bad. It's like, it's like, on a scale of one to ten, New York was maybe like an eight, and then Los Angeles is maybe like a five. It's like a lot better. So there's my little thing. New York is just like everything. Los Angeles, I feel like, is for like dreamers. You know, like oh yeah, I want to be successful in LA. That's for dreamers. Los Angeles has everything. It has like it's got warm weather all the time, surfing. Blah, 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 blah. It's all entertainment. However, New York is like real life. It's got the history behind it. You'll be, I feel like you'd be more successful there because everything is better. I feel like everything's better in New York. Oh yeah, and one other um, pro about Los Angeles is in and out So freaking good. Um, yeah. Either way, both cities suck because you'll find tourists like me. I'm not a tourist in um, New York, I feel like, because I've been there so many times that I know my way around everything. So it's good. Um, but yeah, hope you enjoyed my four minute, 39 second deal. Um, and I'll get back to the cool Los Angeles stuff. By the way, this is my house and this is the garden. It's very cool. Oh, uh, 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 that's better. Tickets are $16 and in North Carolina, they're like <clears throat> $9.50. Hi. You already know, Jack Reacher, whatever it is, never walked back. We're going down. I've seen these kind of movie theaters in New York. They go down because they're just like so busy or whatever. Look at this. Spooky. The theater. Jack Reacher. The boys. I bet you've never seen an escalator in a movie theater before. I sure have, because I'm on it right now. Um, good movie, Jack Reacher. Recommend it was good action thing. <laughs>